Dragon, he muted you because you were screaming at your TV. If you don't want to be muted, learn to mute yourself or lower your voice. Now, I'm just telling you, man. You gotta learn to control your, uh, mood. Whatever you want to call it. Your rage. I didn't mute you because you were bothering me, Dragon. I muted you so I could talk to Aaron. So we could start to play together on a hey, dude. Well, it had to do with it. What? Hey, I said, I don't think I did it so you could hear me. I'm all reaching part of your choice. What did he say, Gary? The party where you can, the party where you can ask to be unmuted, and the person doesn't comply, the party where you can pretty much. Yes, can. but if Dragon wants to yell at his TV, we have the right to mute him. If he kicks us, I'll start my own party. And anyone yeah. backing Jeffrey up will not be invited. So Dragon has every right to kick us, I mean, you know, it's his party, but, you know, he can at least respect our wishes to keep his voice down. Bob only muted him to avoid, uh, you know, a fight because he's yelling and he wanted to talk to me without upsetting Dragon. If Dragon can't learn to keep his voice down, then he's going to get muted to resolve any fights. Dragon can lower his voice or he can get used to the mute button.